Greetings and salutations everyone, I'm Ekmek, this is Let's Play Tokyo Mirage Sessions. In the last episode, I don't know what we did, it's been so long. But it struck me that this episode, we should at least start off with Tsubasa. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, what do I do, what do I do, Itsuki? Except the saintly... Mm. I'm a little busy right now. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Level 47! That's... Hmm... So, what I was saying was, I looked at what it said in the guide for all those with dialogue options, and technically, we could get Fallen Star now. Because, like they said, you can have it as soon as Chapter 3. What they left out was that it's an incredible level difficulty spike, so Subas is going to be on hold for a while. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I guess that means, uh, topic. So all of you use topic to contact each other when an incident occurs, right? Makes me jump every time I get a message. I'm not used to this. I guess that means we should go tackle what Barry has to say. Wait, a new side story in now available. Good job, quality control. Hey Itsuki, Tsubasa is just awful today. Please, you gotta come help me. Come to Lesson Studio ASAP! Okay, I guess he's waiting outside it for us. And of course, by starting the episode I forgot what it was that I wanted to show off. Whoops. Either way, if you did somehow have the ability to complete that mission, you'd get seven minutes just for complete. You'd get seven points just for completing it, as well as three possible options to get to one point each, and that adds up to a good ten. Ah, uh, Subasa needs my contact, I guess. Hey, ski help! I'm at our office right now. Please come here. I guess it's a little late, but I wonder what Yashiro Shurigi was doing inside the well, idolosphere. Why is Tsubasa's kiss all over topic? Ooh! Hi, Itsuki. Thank you for coming. Tsubasa's... Tsubasa's... Only you... Accept the errand comedy, only you? Hi. あの、フルコープしないことにはつばさのレースに集中できないのです。いかせてください。いかせてください。うん。だからそれは困りますってば。あ、いつきくん。あのね、バリーさんがひどいの。I can see that. 一体何が起こってるんだ？というか守りストラップって？守りストラップは守りのストラップだろうが、そんなことはもうわからねえのか。しかし限定版はすでにどこも売り切れ。氷はもはやショートです。グッドバムサートマンです。バッチ。しかし
Why don't I go for you? Let's go. それでバリーさんが真面目にレッスンつけてくれるならいや計算通りです計算<笑>なんでもないです You're scheming good for nothing ですかうだつが上がらないガキかと思ってましたがなかなかどうして気が回るじゃないですかオーケー交渉成立です Oh no, is today the day that they do tidying up around the community? Alright, I apologize if you start hearing a leaf blow or something. And yes, Itsuki isn't mincing words on how much of an unreasonable jerk k a p e r r y is being. Get thee to a h e h o m a r There your path shall be open to onto you. You know, the more you pest me with texts, the less likely it is that I'm going to get there in time, simply because I have to stop and open each and every one of them, Barry. <laughs> I like Shibuya. It's got its ups and downs, but it's the best place to see young people genuinely expressing themselves. Hey Ellie. <sighs> Looks like my dramas hit a plateau with viewer numbers. I think we could get more if they focused the spotlight more on me. I need a member in charm. But they keep saying strap. Do they mean things like phone straps? Of course you are. Is that Anna Charm at work? ぜひお願いします。それじゃあ、トピの方がわかりやすいわよね。送ってあげるからアイディー教えて。ノーノー、イトマイビーアトリックフォーアスフォーヘーとゲットアトピックアイディーソーダンウィシキンネパストラスウ
You'd think that she'd have access to plenty of them. そうだったんですか。守り、どこにいるかわかります。さあ。でも譲ってもらうのはちょっと難しいかもね。とっても喜んでたから、守りちゃん。まあ、聞くだけ聞いてみます。Maiko looks so cheerful that we're going to have a rough time ahead of us. Yeah, actually... Yeah, we need to get Kiryu's stage rank up in order to access the next X story, but... To do that, we have to go into dungeons. Hey, Itsuki, did you buy the charm? Come back to base and report in. Didn't even get a chance to finish reading that. Well, well, I did, but only barely. He's really impatient. Come on, come on, come on, millennial boy. I was getting tired of waiting for you. Hurry up and get inside. So you haven't been doing any training while I've been gone? I suppose it was that it was that close of a walk that it wouldn't matter. I can't exactly say it didn't serve Barry right. Sorry, but you can't have this. What? Rewarded for his bad behavior. Like, you can tell that they don't mean it to come off badly, but it does, or maybe they're just really daft about it all. I don't know, people always say it's better to just play it for the gameplay than it for the story. But then on the flip side, if you're like me and an idiot playing on the hard difficulty, then the gameplay is kind of rough as well. I'm sorry Barry, were you saying something? Audacity's waveforms looked more interesting than what the thing you had to say. Subasa, she just wants her lesson. Side story only you complete. I mean, she needs it. You saw the level of her side quest. 
Oh great, we made him a memory me a memory. I've never been promo. You're taught the art of finding joy in this shabby, undeserving 3D world by Barry. From now on you get more money from session bonuses. It's a Fumi Yamada. Anyway, as it was saying a second ago, he's a Mamori Maniac. Great. And the problem is we really can't do Subasa's quest because it gave us a level warning, which means that there's going to be some sort of boss or another, so... How about this? Let's skim a he uh, hello? Thank you very much for your help. With Uncle and Mr. Drog, I'll do my best as master from this point on. Alright, so step one, go inside. Step two, get into a fight with the first guy we see. Because we need to show off memory in battle. It does look kind of like she's coming in on a rocket, so the whole spacesuit armor isn't the worst. But still, I don't like it. Oh, that's a very impressive first move. Thank you, memory. And now everyone hits this one unfortunate Pegasus Knight. Oh, I should probably turn off quick session just so we can see her act someone for once. And now we can use session from axe skills, provided they aren't immune to axe damage. We've run out of room for session skills, so this is kind of problematic. Especially since Itsuki can't session from ice, which means that it has to be physical attacks from memory, or it has to be, um, what's it? It has to be Zen skills from uh, Kyria. Anyway, with that done, um, now to skim ahead and try and find the other thing that I wanted to show here.
Oh! Well, there's something new. But yes, what I was actually hoping to show and so far haven't had the chance to... I was hoping that... Um, so there was the gold mirage that I saw in the background ages ago. I realized that, hey, that might be the reason why there's so many pieces of equipment that I can't do anything about. Unfortunately, it seems like they're a lot rarer than I gave them credit for. And this is kind of interesting, that there's this massive extra route to go down. Maybe this is why I was having such a hard time with Drog, because I should have gone down here. You are not the good shadow I wanted. I feel like in this area I've only ever seen them spawn in one place ever, which is at the end of the walkway. Yeah, right around there. <laughs> Screw you all. Now Memory can't join in because she can't combo off of ice into ice. I do wonder though if maybe um, that Memory gets both split for a session skill because that would be devastating since anything that flies is weak to act is a lance user in this game. Yes. You know what, as nice as it is to give her this time in this spotlight. Also, I think we've had enough time with sessions here going on there as long as they do. <laughs> we don't need that. Wind split would be nearly as good since everything that's weak to bows and weak to axes. Uh, well, anything weak to bows is weak to wind, and well, yeah. All the flyers are lance wielders in this game. They're basing it off the original. Actually, let's just check the topic. I should have scolded, I should scold Memory for going off on her own. But if it wasn't for her, things go on really ugly. I guess Memory's song is really what touches Barry's heart the most. Make sure you watch after Memory too now. Got that? Looks like Barry's doing okay. Michael just told me right now. It's kind of funny how he's just the same as before. It's all, thanks to all of you that I can still laugh like this. Thank you. 
Got the Memorin charm, thank you Memorin fans everywhere. Sigh. I guess since that we got that extra rank for Kyria, we don't need her in the cast. Memorin, come back, you can blame it all on me. And I think that if I were to... Okay, I'll try this. Ribarama. If worse comes to worse, then I can just off-screen and start an episode in a battle against the Golden Mirage. の ビオル、私に力を貸して。それは無理だ。セッション。行ける。ビオル、外すんじゃないの。ガッチリみたいね。よろしく。次頼むぜ。お願い。やった。あれ、もう終わり。来たか。there! There, there, there! That was about to end the episode, but no, we have this guy. First strike on a rare enemy encounter. Oh boy, here's hoping. Oh, did you? Did you see how little damage he was taking? But we get a Maka Converter. And I believe... We get a Matador, the Obelisk, the Yamatsu Yuhurasaka, the Lorelei, and Ushimitsu Yorimasa. So let's just um, end the episode by reporting out. I don't get why they give me report stones because I really don't need them. Uh, do you have anything new to say? Hmm. No, he doesn't. Alright, each of these new weapons. The Matador gives us an Alter Darkness, removes our electric resistance, but also removes... A, basically, it removes most of our elemental weaknesses, but it also removes our elemental defenses. Skill-wise, Profuri would be useless, Dual Dispatch would be fantastic, and uh, we could also get some Evasion up, which is nice. The Maka Converter could give her the Obelisk, which really changes her elementals, actually. She'd actually lose that wind weakness. But then she'd get a nice weakness to make up for it. And give her Agi Lao? That's a weird one. 
Pertuma, the Mecha Converter gives us Yamotsu Huraska. That's a lot of weaknesses, but an ult of wind. And it gives him wind strike. But. Ooh. Medium lance on all enemies. Not bad. We haven't made one of these yet. Well, this at least gives us something new for her. But more important is Lurley. It, it gives her an extra physical weakness to bows. On, a, on an elemental level, I don't feel like this one's worth it. Although it does remove her element into weakness completely. Megiddo, though. Hmm. And they were nice enough to start us off on this one. She gets physical weaknesses to everything. But loses any elemental weakness. Wait, no, not that one. I feel like, ironically, despite this probably making her stupidly uh, risky versus anything and everything. This is probably what we want. Especially since we have Mamarin with us, actually, because we can. Uh, Mamarin has the ability to block a lot of incoming attacks. And... Alright, so I've been thinking this over. I've decided that whenever I have a Master Seal on hand, when someone finishes all three of their side quests, that's when I'm going to upgrade them to... that's when I'm going to use a Master Seal on them. I've also decided that I'm going to just uh, make things easy on myself and always pick the top option. Since Itsuki doesn't have any side questing, I feel safest upgrading Chrom right now. Even though I like the looks of them all right now, I want Krom to grow, go Great Lord because he gets uh, more healing spells, and that's important since Itsuki is always in the party. And this is definitely over time, but I'm going to cut a lot out due to that long hunt for Watsons. You don't stuff light into a vampire. What were you thinking? A play record was obtained. A great lord is born. A new skill awakens within the reborn mirage. Krom can now use the special performance Raging Blast. One or more new carnages has been unlocked through class change. We got Floret, we got the Soul Carti, and we got Miscellane. 
I recognize two of those references. It's slightly rude that they gave you the um. It's a bit, a little bit rude that uh, there's achievements tied to specific class changes. So what you take, if you wanted to get everything achievements wise, then well, you'd have to play through New Game Plus and spend all the master seals on the opposites. Yeah, yeah, either way, this is where the episode ends. Next time on Let's Play Tokyo Mirage Sessions, um, I guess Kyria isn't available yet. Uh, what's up, Yukutuma? Damn it, Barry, why'd you have to go and pull this crap? But I guess I kind of see where he was coming from. So what exactly do the Mirages even want, anyway? Uh, Krom, do you have anything new to say? No, just the same as usual. And the computer says... Curious side story will begin shortly. So next time on Let's Play Tokyo Mirage Sessions, we get a topic from Kyria and we start our side quest. Until then guys, take care, I'll see you all around.